Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be checking out more Coromon and finally I have gotten back, and I mean finally in the nicest way possible, I really do. I finally got into the area where the demo ended so long ago. Again, this game has been being worked on since 2014 and I've been playing the demo since then. A couple of times, like once a year almost, uh, since the game has come out. Uh, almost once a year. They didn't get a whole... I didn't, I didn't meet the Coromon devs for a long time, so it maybe wasn't once a year, but... We're gonna hop back into this today, and everything from here on out is brand. Listen here, Beasel. I need you. I need you to take a seat. You're level 10. Why are you bothering me? Go away. Quad bolt him, Watsby. Thank you. All right, great. Now, everything past this fight. Oh, we got a level up. Past this fight is brand new to me. I don't know what's beyond this right here, because normally both the creators put their developer thing, like their their models here, and it's sad again. It's another, another scenario where it's sad to not see them there. But anyway, let's do it. Into this forest we go. The soggy swamp. Welcome to the soggy swamp. Make sure you brought an extra pair of socks. I'm not even wearing socks. Oh, what? Don't move! The foreign substance scanner has detected something po uh, potently harmful. I'll handle this, scouts. You step back, please. Show us. What did you bring in your ba in the backpack of yours? Uh, no, not that. You're, that's just your average everyday cake. How about this? Stop messing with me. <laughs> Do you have anything that that radiates or that could even be smelly oh I think I know ah I heard this I heard the scanner uh, that must be the culprit it's the energy it's the energy they call the Titan essence Titan essence we've heard about that we've heard about that from the scout master didn't we yeah he said that a long. He said a long. He said that long ago, Titans created this whole planet. The same energy flows through all organic beings, be especially Coromon. Scoutmaster would definitely approve this item, don't you think, guys? Are they? Are they kids? Asfo says I'll whitelist it in the machine so you can pass freely. Great. There, you can come through now. So, are you some kind of bouncers? Oh, of course. Let us introduce ourselves. We are the Soggy Scouts. Wild. We're the official caretakers of the Soggy Swamp, protecting the environments in our game. Oh, uh, well, who else can who else can call the area call the area from the scented super shrooms? Scented super shroom. Oh, they must be the glowing shrooms that keep popping up every now and then. Look up there. Yeah, and then look over there. See that? Ah, yeah. If we uh, if we don't snip them, they take over everything. But we can't do it alone. That's why we ask everyone to help. Lend a hand. Pocket snips. Okay. You're not you're not the only one helping us. Snipping snipping shrooms uh, could be valuable for you too. Snip, snip enough shrooms, and Esfo will give you, will help you make your own Coromon sense. Oh, that's so cool! Interested? Okay, uh, let's just take a look at the scent recipe book then. Woo! I'm gonna look immediately if I can make if I can make potent ones though. But stay sharp when snipping shrooms. There's only a 10 second window. Our pantlet will explain more. I love this. Right, Mr. Chance. Okay. Please sit the center shrooms when they are ripe. Got it. Definitely not ripe. So it's when they're glow, big and glowy. Okay. Zen, sweat, mint, sweet, grim fungus. Got it. But no worries if you miss one. They just run off to the next one. Or wait a few minutes and then ripe again. All right. Soggy Scouts, out. There they go. Wild. So first things first. 
Can I? Ah, you can! It just takes a lot. Okay, got it. Wait. You can make Pokemon. Yeah. Some berry I don't know, but I'm assuming the 10, 15, and 10, 15, 15 that's there is the orange, the blue, and the the purple things. And the and the the, the other the yellow berry is the burr mushroom. Bur the burr berry, which we can we've been growing. I've been growing those, so that's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, what was I doing? I wanted to go into my clothing and switch to my orange vest. Thank you, vest. Oh, nice. Excellent. Very cool. All right, cool. Very cool. Boat. Can't use that. I think I saw a chest over here. Nice. I wonder what Coromon are available in this area. I wonder... Probably the Tattles, right? Probably Tattles. You bum. I got a Gauss Slime at level 7. I could have caught one here at level 19. That's very upsetting. Swarm Diversion! <clears throat> well, we know this guy doesn't have a lot of good moves. He has all electric moves at this point. So that means we are pretty safe, actually. We can probably fight this guy just fine. Because we have Energy Drain. I wonder how much damage he does now. That's okay. It's not that bad. Could be better, I suppose. Disable? Oh, that's the worst. Well, you know, Goss Slime actually probably doesn't have a lot of good special defense anyway, so we probably could get away with... Right. at all. Lightning Strike would have missed. Great, 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 great. Oof. Okay. I am trying to fight this thing. I am trying to fight this thing with... Oh, it's no longer disabled. Yes. So it's going to cost three use and give us back a good portion, too. Yes, Watsby. Let's go. Dude, there's no reason to not fight Coromon of the same level as you because it's they just, they just give a lot of experience. All right. Those fireflies are. Oh, as a trainer, of course, of course. I want to find a new Coromon. I want to find a new Coromon for the team. Unless it's just Beazle, Beazle, Gauss Slime. I bet Tattles are here. I bet there's Tattles here. Okay, we almost two shot him. We do 27 damage. Yeah, all right, we got this. I believe. Plus, it's evolved. That was crit. Couldn't be crit in the first one? Come on, Watsby. Nice. Look at that. Beauteous. I might even look at the level up right now. I'm just trying to find some new Coromon. You know, we might just have to check the grass as we go through, because I don't feel like we're going to get any new Coromon just yet. Although I'm kind of excited because... Although I'm kind of excited because it looks like, woo! Well, there, well, I get, I'm excited. Sorry, what I was gonna say was that I'm very excited because there's no guarantee that these guys all have electric Coromon like they did in the tower. So hopefully we'll be doing much better this time around. This thing's like 20. Like the exact same, oh, hey, we got a shock. Let's go. Win last one. Can we take that? Yes, we can, all right. All right, I'm still at 10 out of 30, 20 out of 30. Good, going down. Critical hit, again with the crits. Nice, let's go, Watsby. Thousand for that, let's go. We got whoosh. What is whoosh? The user launches a speedy, uh, uh, sorry, a speedy whoosh of wind. The power increases with, increases with the speed of the user and decreases with the speed of the, sorry, what? Oh, okay, I understand now. Okay, I get it. Um. I'm done with that. I'll do that instead of Electrify. Nice. 44? 44, baby. Nice. Nice and even. Bitty Bolt. Oh, it's Bitty Bolt! What up, Bitty Bolt? Wait, are you electric? 
course you are. You're an electric Coromon. No, you're standard. Oh, well, you are standard electric Coromon. You're weak to cut and ground. I could. I could whoosh. I'm gonna whoosh. Nice. I took that. Took that with no problem. Whoosh, baby. What? The user launch is a speedy whoosh of wind. The power, the power increases with the speed of the user and decreases with the speed of the attack target. So if it's fast, oh, it works like, oh, okay. I thought it was tailwind or something like that. It's not, it's not that. I see. So if Watsby is fast, like I would send fast Watsby after some slow other Coromon and it would do lots of damage. Bolt bomb. Well, that was... Oh, I thought... Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. He used all of his SP for that. Uh, he has to rest this turn. I might as well swap into something else. Let's go Watsumata. Yeah, he has to rest this turn. Really? How much damage is that supposed to do? Because that, like... I feel like they didn't do anything to me. That was very uh, anticlimactic, if you will. Nice, very cool. Got him. I wonder where he was. I remember them talking about it in the Discord that that that, that core was gonna be in the game. I just didn't find it. Let's do let's do another one. Oh, the cute pose. Is that my defense? Okay, never mind. For some reason, I thought it was my attack. Like, Q-Pose gets rid of my attack stat. I don't know why I thought that. I don't know why I thought that. 702, baby. Let's go. Level 26. I wonder when Watsumata evolves, actually. I wonder when, like, three-stage Coromon... Like, what's the what's the regular for three-stage Coromon to evolve? Like, is it going to be 30? I don't have a mushrooms for that. Sweet. Nice. How do I do this? Oh, I got it! Sweet! Oh, there are so many trainers here. Some more patches of grass, that's cool. Like, I'm just gonna run around and get stuff. Like, and whatever I run into, hopefully it's something different. You know what though? I don't mind running into these beezles though, because beezles are good experience, so that's good. It's not very strong, is it? Oof. The Juba Fruit! I forgot about the Juba Fruit. Everybody got basically got one shot in, in the Titan fight, so I didn't really they didn't really get to eat their berries. Yeah, I'm just gonna use Quad Bolt, dude. Oh no! A stab move. I hate that move. Magic, let's go. Energy drink. Oh, he's so fast! Are we speed tied? We must be speed tied. Okay. Slaps, come on out, buddy. Give it a good old pow. Oh. Sticky lair. Sticky lair. Dude, Slaps is becoming one of my favorites. Just just abilities-wise, it's becoming one of my favorites. 207, let's go. You get 207, 207, 207, 271 is what I meant to say. Yeah, dude, Watsby's caught up, man. No new Coromon yet, though. I definitely need to bring uh, uh, Watsby back to life, though. Uh... Phoenix shot. Wonderful. Oh, there's a box over there. Are you gonna? Ooh, you turned. Thank you for turning. Nice. Oh, okay. Cool. I really thought. What are you? A Drupal. Oh, and you're potent. And level 19. Wait, are you weak to... Oh, you're a ghost. Okay, we got a, we got a Drupal. This is, this is a first. I don't know what a Drupal is. All right, I don't want to kill it. I don't think I will, though. I'm going to use magic. Energy green, let's go. Oh, 
Oh boy. I really thought that was gonna... I... We'll get chop. Alright, uh... I think Slaps has Taser. Let's throw out Slaps. Okay. I'm excited! It's our first... Dude, I was looking for a brand new Coromon. We got a potent one right here. Let's go. It's got Shade Walker. Okay. It's got Shade Walker. It's got Chomp. <laughs> Drupal. What a name. All right. Let's, let's taser it real quick. Taser! Don't run. Don't you run. Sticky Saliva? Sticky Lair affects that. What does Sticky Saliva do to me? Speed decrease battle. Oh! Did it do damage? I didn't see if it did damage or not. Trick Spinner. Trick Spinner is more effective used at the start of the battle. Spinner that makes it easier to catch Sleeping Coromon. Oh, okay. Let's do... Oh, this kind of matches them, though. Let's do the Dream Spinner. Oh, come on! I like that it has a... Yeah, okay, so it doesn't do any damage. But we lose two levels of speed when we do it? Interesting. One more. Uh, let's do it again. We have one more Dream Spinner. Let's use the Dream Spinner again. I'm sure that we can buy spinners later on at some point in time. Come on. Yes! We got Drupal! Let's go! Uncommon, Soggy Swamp. Chomp, Sticky Saliva, it has Feelers and Shade Walker. Okay. It isn't holding anything. Resistant. The Coromon doesn't mind doesn't mind special attacks and reduces their damage with 25%. <laughs> so you're telling me we would have one-shot it. Interesting. So were you a special wall then? Special defense, 21. I don't know. I don't know. Join the squad. Drupal, join the squad. Let's go! I almost want to check, like, the logbook for it to see if, like, it's supposed to be a special defender then. Because that would be kind of cool. I might as well just raise its special defense, though, for that. Oh, I grabbed... I picked, I picked the wrong thing by accident. Hey, what did we get? Ooh, fire spinners? Hot spinners. I'm imagining that's for burned Coromon, I would imagine. Or maybe they're just for, like, uh... Drupal. Where's Drupal? We're going to check this out together. Drupal. Drupal. Dru is it the very last one? Scar. Drupal! What? Oh, right. We found a potent one. I forgot. We don't know what a regular one looks like. Drupal is constantly dripping dripping ooze. Uh, and that leaves puddles that, that leaves puddles behind that can grow into additional Drupal. Really? That's right. We're going to Pawberry. Pawberry and the Soggy Swamp. We have to go through there. Gourmad, uh, Sticky Lair, and Resistance. I like Resistance. Yeah, it looks like it could be. It looks like it could be a special defensive uh, attacker. I'm uh, sorry, a special uh, like a a special defensive wall, if you will. It's ghost type, so I don't know if that's great, but that's cool. I like that. I want to give it a name, but I can't think of one for it. Drupal's a really good name. I don't know. Drupal's a really good name. Um, maybe like, oh, I don't know. You know what? We'll come back to it. We can nickname. Yeah, let's cancel that. We can give them nicknames at any point in time, so I might as well just wait a minute. Like, I might as well just wait a minute. Instead of rushing for it, like, I changed Dove Fridge's name, like, four times because I didn't know what I actually wanted. Let's check and see if we can move its moves around, too. Like, I wonder if, like... Nope, these are the four it comes with. Chomp is a foul move, apparently. Normal. Normal. Close. All right, cool. All right. Well, we got, we got, we got a new, we got, we got what we asked for. That is, that is for, oh, that's how you leave. I think. What's, what's through here? Oh, more swamp. Oh, Bastion. Yes. Uh, it's Velma from the RD lab. My daughter, Asfo, Asfo told me that you were, uh, you were there Sorry, you were trans transversing the Soggy Swamp? Tra transversing? Traversing? Traversing the Soggy Swamp? You see, I am extremely close to finishing something. 
something uh, which might be a great breakthrough for battle researchers everywhere. That sounds awesome. What is it? The aroma module. I've been dissecting the I've, I've been dissecting the pheromone molecules that Coromon give off in the wild. No big deal. Just my area of expertise. I just need a couple. I just need a couple of smelly shrooms to polish off my research. Since you're in the soggy swap, do you mind helping me out? I'll certainly make it worth your while. It's a win-win for both of us. Yeah, that's right. Deal. Great. My thanks. Two sweet shrooms, two zen shrooms, and two grim shrooms. Oh, and one beer fruit as well. Okay. Nice. Okay. Uh, where were you at? Phone. Oh! The Campus Trainers Hub, Floor 1. I think that's the Pokemon Center. I could be wrong, though. Anyway. All right. I think that's enough for today, guys. I just hit time. So if you guys are really enjoying, hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you, your favorite Coromon is at this point in time since what we've been through. Or maybe you found something that I didn't find on the way up into the Soggy Swamp. Anyway, guys, this is all brand new stuff. So I'm super excited. Be sure to, You'll be sure to see another episode soon. I probably might be uploading these things two a day. I'm not really sure at this point. But if you did enjoy, hit the subscribe button for more Coromon content, or if you're enjoying all the indie games that I have here on the channel too, or you want to see them live, head over to twitch.tv slash rules, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Now I'm the king of the swingers, oh, the jungle VIP. I've reached the top and had to stop, and that's what's bothering me. I want to be